This is a job I volunteered to do for a guy from Vintage Vehicle Forum. What we have here is the exhaust manifold from a 1911 Renault, where the internal thread that retains the downpipe has almost completely rusted away. The obvious way to set this up would be with an adjustable angle plate, but I don't have one. So instead I have set up my CNC converted mill with a virtual B-axis. It already has a swivelling head, so I have set the CNC controller up to swing the Z-axis to the same angle. As I jog in Z or X, the horizontal and vertical axes move simultaneously in proportions governed by trigonometry running in a kinematics module. There is no actual link between the two, I just need to set them up to match. There was just enough rusted thread that I could make an aluminium plug to screw in and use that to pick up the angles using a dial indicator. What I was doing here was adjusting the virtual B angle while traversing the indicator up and down the aluminium plug. Eventually I settled on an angle of 29.8 degrees. And then the angle in the other plane was adjusted by tapping the casting with a hammer. I then did another iteration at the XZ plane angle. But this is a tenths indicator, so I consider this quite good enough for the job at hand. I then used my coaxial indicator to pick up the centre of the hole. It's a matter of just turning the X and Y until the swing of the needle is minimised. I'm using my wool halter boring and phasing head with a shortened lathe internal threading tool to single point cut the new thread. To cut the thread I use a G33.1 tapping cycle. This moves the z-axis in strict proportion to the spindle, spindle angle, so by turning down the spindle override until the spindle stops, it is possible to align the tool with the existing thread. At the end of each cycle, I stop the spindle, add some more cut, 
and then run the cycle again. I took the thread only just big enough to get almost a complete thread. I wanted to leave as much original exhaust as possible. 